Here is my die from Spellbinders. I love that they're always bronze. I cut 10 pieces, 5 gold and 5 silver for my project for 10 on the 10th Christmas cards, as you saw earlier. I definitely have my work cut out for me. I affixed all the pieces to black cardstock, 5 by 4 and a quarter, to go on my card bases, which I will do that later. I'm affixing the poinsettias first, and I did cut those out with a separate die. Unfortunately, I didn't think to put the gold dots on first, and so I will do that next time. I'm using Elmer's Craft Bond. There's three in a package, very inexpensive from Amazon. I'm dabbing it on with a sponge. Meanwhile, listen to some music. showing each process for a couple of cards just enough for you to get the idea and I don't want to take forever okay here I am using the blizzard glitter drops but when it dried you can see already they're starting to turn a little bit blue there so when it dried it ended up being green so that was kind of crazy so on the next one I decided to use the glossy white and I just use that for the rest of the cards and they turned out really nicely. I'm putting the holly leaves on and again I'm just going to show you a couple of the pieces I did first before I go ahead and attach the joy pieces and I used nine patterns total so I only had to use one pattern twice so that worked out really well these are the scraps from my vintage classic Christmas set that I've been trying to use up all year and I thought this was perfect for it. So again, sit back and enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> 